dimly lit streets were shrouded in an eerie silence as darkness engulfed the town. It was a night like any other, or so the residents believed. Little did they know that an ancient curse had awakened, bringing with it a malevolent force that would haunt their nightmares. A sinister presence had taken the FORM of a killer clown, a creature with a macabre smile that sent shivers down the spines of anyone unfortunate enough to lay eyes upon it. The first victim was a young woman named Emily. She had always been captivated by the circus. With its vibrant colors and joyful atmosphere. One fateful night, as she walked home alone, a figure emerged from the shadows, adorned in tattered clown attire. Its face was painted white, with grotesque red lips stretched wide in a horrifying grin. Emily's heart raced as the clown's bloodshot eyes locked onto her. She tried to scream, but no sound escaped her throat. The killer clown moved with unnatural agility, its elongated limbs contorting in grotesque ways as it closed in on Emily. With each step, it emitted a low, chilling laughter that echoed through the empty streets. Panic overwhelmed Emily, and she stumbled backward, desperately searching for an escape. But the clown was relentless, toying with her, taunting her with its eerie presence. Emily's worst nightmares became her reality as the clown's hands transformed into razor-sharp claws. With a swift motion, it lunged at her, its claws tearing through the air. The young woman's screams finally filled the night. But they were quickly silenced by the gurgling sound of her own blood. As word spread of Emily's grisly demise, the town fell into a state of paranoia. The once cheerful community became a ghost town, its inhabitants too terrified to leave their homes after nightfall. But even in the supposed safety of their own houses, they were not immune to the killer clown's reign of terror. It was during the midnight hour that the clown would strike again, preying on unsuspecting victims in the most unexpected ways. One by one, the residents met their gruesome demise. Their lives extinguished by the sadistic clown's hands. No matter where they hid, it would find them, its laughter echoing through the walls as they cowered in fear. The survivors banded together, their desperation giving birth to a glimmer of hope. They sought answers. Delving into the dark history of their town, desperate to break the curse that had brought the killer clown upon them. It was said that a long-forgotten circus had once inhabited the town, its performers succumbing to madness and violence before disappearing without a trace. In their relentless pursuit of the truth, the survivors stumbled upon an ancient tome hidden deep within the town's library. Its pages revealed a ritual, the only known way to banish the malevolent force that had plagued their lives. With trembling hands and hearts filled with determination, they set out to perform the ritual, hoping against hope that it would be their salvation. The night of reckoning arrived, and the survivors gathered in the abandoned circus grounds, a place tainted by the curse that had spawned the killer clown. They chanted ancient incantations, their voices trembling with fear and anticipation. As the last syllable echoed through the air, a blinding light erupted, enveloping the circus grounds and banishing the darkness that had consumed the town. When the light faded, the survivors cautiously opened their eyes. The killer clown had vanished, leaving behind only the faint echo of its sinister laughter. The town slowly emerged from its collective nightmare, forever scarred by the horrors they had endured. But in the depths of their minds, they knew that the memory of the killer clown would linger, haunting their dreams and reminding them of the darkness that could lurk beneath the surface of even the most innocent places. The curse had been broken, but the scars would forever serve as a reminder of the terror they had faced and survived.